North Carolina Prepper. <clears throat> I'll give you guys a quick update. Um, I was doing a video Sunday, messing around, and uh, I was out there picking up a sewing machine, or no, wait, not a sewing machine, a bench top tactical thread injector. Anyway, this uh, pit bull comes running around the corner and attacks me. And I uh, couldn't, couldn't use my pistol because my wife and my dog were in the line of sight. So um, I jumped on this thing. It was actually going for my dog, I think. And then my dog panicked and wrapped its big leash wrapped around the wife and like cocooned her in a leash. So anyway, I jumped this thing. I started beating on it and beating on it. Now, this knuckle is all swollen, but you can't really see it. But um, sometimes the firearm just doesn't help. Or for whatever reason you're unable to use it. But uh, the owner got over there and called the dog off, or the guy apologized profusely. So I didn't press any charges, and I didn't really get hurt. I mean, I mean I'm sore and everything, but it was an unexpected threat that I hadn't really prepared for. I just figured, oh well, I had a pistol, I could just deal with it. In this particular case, I was unable to deal with it because of the circumstances of the line of sight my target and what was beyond my target. Even if I were to hit the dog with 38, maybe it would have went through and hit my dog or my wife, so that wasn't it wasn't an option. Um, so you gotta prepare for threats you don't know about or expect and that's really a hard thing to do. Because I figured, oh I would just deal with it one way if it ever happened. Well it happened and I was unable to use my, my planned course of action. So, you know, my hand's sore. It's all cut up, too. But, that's when the dog's, I guess, teeth, right? Beat it. Um, had all the shots and everything, so I didn't go get rabies or anything like that. But, still, you gotta prepare. I, I'll try to get some more videos out today and stuff. Um, I dropped my phone in the thing and can't extract the video from it, but I'll just make another video. It's not a big deal. Alright, please rate and subscribe, everybody, and please stay on your toes. There's a lot of threads. People tend to get sidetracked on and focus on one thing, tunnel vision. If I wasn't paying attention I mean, to one object, I should say if I, if I didn't have tunnel vision, I would have saw this aggressive pit bull long before it even got a chance to run up on me. So it was completely my fault for a lack of observation. That won't happen again. But my hands all sore, my fingers are kind of numb. So there's probably some damage, I don't know. But anyway, uh, please rate and subscribe and please have a great day. Let's get pepper out.